Well, after watching Draymond Green uh, go virtual with Jamal Murray before game one, Kenny wanted to get a piece of that action. So using high-speed 5G technology, AT&T was able to transport the jet from our studio in Atlanta to the NBA campus in Orlando so he could conduct his own hollow interview with a fellow Tar Heel, the Lakers' Danny Green. Hey, what's up? I'm here in Atlanta, getting ready to go to Orlando in the bubble. That's right. I'm going to meet my main man, Danny Green. Danny Green, little runner in the lane. Danny Green, trying to pack it through. Good. And I'm going to be in a hologram, so let's go. Let's get it done. Ah. Whoa. <laughs> what's up, my man? What's, what's up? up? What's up, man? What's How you up? doing? Good. What's up, Tar Heel? Brethren, firstly, congratulations. Thank you, thank you. I mean, you. I'm just happy to be part of the Danny Green party during the, the conference finals. We still have a lot more to achieve. For us, this season was not just to make it to the conference finals. This series, fortunate enough, we got to win the first, which is great. But we've been building off that. Hopefully, continue to keep that hunger, that, that edge, that, um, and not be satisfied, and uh, continue to grow and learn as a group. The Lakers just destroying Denver in transition. You get an opportunity to be in a unique environment with the bubble. There is no home court advantage, and we've seen what Denver has been able to do. Mm -hmm. How do you guys create your own energy? Our bench has been amazing. LeBron gives it up. Nice find. Davis hits a three. The Laker bench erupting. Better than any cheerleader you ever find. They give us that energy. They're talking a little trash here and there, getting other teams' head. Uh, so to have that energy night in, night out, it's a home game for us every night. You have a unique opportunity to play with LeBron as a rookie. Uh, now you're playing season bet. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> he was younger. Obviously, he was a leader. He was still kind of learning, I guess, the small things that how important small things are. End of the day, he's still the same guy as a big goofball, uh, but he does understand the importance of every piece, every play, every possession. He wakes up, you know, with great energy, great positive attitude. So to see him do it for 16, 17 years is unbelievable for me. That's why he's arguably considered, you know, one of the greatest of all time. To make sure that our voices are heard. Justice for Breonna Taylor. We're more than just basketball players. We have to keep doing our part until change really comes. There's been a lot of social issues, obviously, with the names on the back of the jerseys and all the things mm -hmm. that we talked about. What social message is it you would like to let us know about right now? We're here to use our platforms. We love to play basketball. We love to compete. But more important to us is our communities and our people back home. Every chance I get, I try to use that platform to come back to those families and those names, the Breonna Taylors, the Jacob Blakes, the George Floyds, uh, and, and make sure that those names are continuously heard until they get justice. Between Dwight Howard and Anthony Davis, they have taken the Joker out of this game. The length right here is so tough to the Lakers. You got a lot of juggling on your plate with Jokic and Murray and the rest of those guys. They have shown they are that the they comeback play kids. differently from night to night. They for, come back. So for sure. What, what is the thought process going into game two? Any basketball person knows is try to limit their two all-stars. We try to limit Jamal, try to limit Jokic. You know, they're, they're very good at what they do. We can't ever be satisfied. We can't ever think, you know, that we got them or that they're broken. Even if we go up 3-0, this team is not a team that ever quits, is always going to fight back. So continue to, you know, bring that, that intensity, that force, that energy, and that edge as if we're still losing the game and losing the series. Well, I appreciate you, man, coming on. My North appreciate Carolina you. Tar Heel brethren, keep thank working you. hard. But I got to get out of here, man. Get thank, me out of here, thank, man. I got to get back. You, you too. Yeah, you see me, you've seen me go in the screen. <laughs> now you see me this, come this to cool, you. This is cool, man. This is dope.